hi guys welcome back to my channel thank you guys so much for being patient with me i had a long break for mental health honestly it's been so really it's been really bad but i'm i'm back so hopefully you guys are okay with this setup at the moment i'm not in my house at the moment i'm in a different place so i hope you guys are okay with this setup so, so this is going to be a pick a card reading about exactly what you need to know right now so we've got group one group two and group three and now i'm going to put some crystal bracelets on so you guys can choose and then we're going to put them on now. So we have group one with the tiger's eye, group two with the blue lace agate, and group three with the ametrine. So let's get started with group number one with the tiger's eye. Hello group number one, let's get started with your reading. So you guys got bring love into the situation, few shite. You have chalastolite, peridot, king of pentacles, the Empress, Page of Swords, and the um, Six of Wands in reverse. We then have the um, Inner Child, Miracle Healing, and Sexuality. So at the moment, I feel like you guys are healing your sexuality. You're healing um, the creative part of you that's kind of feeling a bit low, okay? This, there's a lot of heavy energy at the moment, so I'm not surprised that this, a lot of this came out. A lot of this is to do with the heart chakra, right? and you're, being, you're going through a teaching period right now where you're, the universe is teaching you um, how to basically love yourself and to love people who come in new into your life, okay? Also, my battery is quite low, so I'm not sure how quick this reading, how long this reading is going to be, so I do apologise for that in advance. So basically going through a healing process right now where you're healing your heart. We have healing twice. I do feel like you are healing the past, you're healing past relationships, you're healing yourself and you're definitely going forward to something that's really, really positive. You're really channeling this Empress energy, even if you don't feel like you are, you really are channeling this Empress energy. And with the King of Pentacles, I feel like there could be somebody who have really have made you feel really bad about yourself it could be an earth sign or it could be somebody who's very very stubborn or it could even be your own mental state that's just being very stubborn to you right now and basically you are trying trying to channel this energy of like the empress where you're trying to be really strong and yeah i feel like you're really really succeeding in this you may feel like you're not you may feel like you're going backwards but the page of swords is here to show you that you are in a very good place and you if you're not right now you will be so the advice here is to basically love yourself and to know you are going through a healing process so if something doesn't feel right if this um energy doesn't feel right right now it's because your inner child is really coming up to be loved okay and just know your heart chakra really needs to be looked into right now um and what I mean is to look into it is to possibly do some meditation, do some yoga, um, love yourself, do some self care, possibly like have a bath and um, have a face mask, could be something like that. Could even be something like journaling. Um, something where you just, possibly there's a lot of ancestral patterns coming up and I feel like the universe is here to just teach you full on that this is something that you need to just go through, okay? Show me this is basically like that. So you're going through a healing path of your heart chakra that needs to be healed. And your inner child is really coming up to be um to come up to the surface to be loved and to look into because you're going through family patterns okay and then we have sexuality with teach and heart chakra so i really do feel like you're basically you're being taught now your lesson here is to basically being taught how to set your boundaries and to know that your heart is extremely important and to know that you should look after yourself um, and your sexuality should, they're telling me your sexuality should not be used for the bad, so I'm not sure if any of you are possibly, um, using yourself to manipulate other people, or you're possibly manipulating yourself, saying I'm too fat, I'm too skinny, um, and anything like that, and just know that, obviously I'm not saying that you are, like, manipulating anybody, but you may feel like you are doing that to get love back, which sounds really deep, which it is, but it just feels like you need to look into that, this part and just know what am I missing. Because I feel like you're doing a really, really good job though. I feel like this sexual energy is very, very important. Because I feel like it's very connected to this Empress energy. And I feel like a lot of people are looking at you right now. And thinking, wow, this, this person's got it all sorted. Whereas actually, I feel like you're going through quite an intense time right now. So just to let you know, guys, that we need to know right now is that you're going through a really deep process and you're doing a really, really good job. You have a lot of new opportunities coming towards you that you may not see right now because you may be in this inner child moment, but just to, inner child um, energy, but just to know that you're going through this and you're going to come out of it in a really good way. And the tiger's eye is here to show you that there's a lot of energy coming forward. 
Tiger's Eye is also a very, very positive grounding um, crystal. So it's very, very good to um, help you feel grounded in yourself, okay? And it's also very good for just overall energy and to help you express yourself in a really good way. This is very good for sexuality as well. Okay, so thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for being patient with me, guys. I know I've been away for a very long time, but yeah, I needed, a, I needed a break to be honest, it was getting very, very heavy, the energy. So thank you so much for being patient with me. If this resonated with you, then feel free to um, look at the description down below. I do private readings if you'd like a private reading with me. I'm doing my private readings again. I'm doing 10% off for the whole whole of August. If you're watching this after August, then I will still be doing deals at some point. So just look in the description box down below. Um, if you'd like to like this video, please feel free to. Please feel free to comment and subscribe. If this didn't resonate, then just let it fly. If it did, then please comment down below and I'll speak to you very soon. Bye. Hello, group number two. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. So we have the um, Blue Lace Agate. I think it's what, is, was it Blue Lace Agate? I can't, I, I swear it was Blue Lace Agate. Do you know what, I can't remember. But this, this crystal is very, very good for anxiety. Both of those crystals that I mentioned are good for anxiety. So I can't remember what I said in the beginning, but uh, this is Blue Lace Agate, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, okay, if not, if it's Angel Eye, I'm not sure, but it's similar to that. So let's see what you guys have for group number two of um, what do you need to know right now. We have Conclusions Are Within Reach, Past Life Patterns. We have Calcite, just get those straight, there we go. We have the Nine of Wands. Eight of Pentacles, the world. And we also have Magic of Nature. So as, as I said to group one, my battery is running a bit low. So if this reading is a bit short, then I do apologize for that. So basically you guys are going for a really good time right now. I feel like if you're not feeling like it's a good time right now, you are, you're gonna reap the rewards that you're basically going through. You're going for a really deep process. You're looking at all your past life patterns and you're really kind of facing them head on. I feel like going in nature is gonna really, really help you because it's gonna really help you to set yourself down to the ground, ground yourself and to clear your mind. Conclusions are within reach. It's literally this energy where you feel like you're possibly right on the edge of a breakthrough. You possibly might be holding on to the past too much though. So make sure you're not doing this. Make sure you're moving forward and you're clearing out. Calcite is gonna be a really, really good crystal for you and possibly Okanite as well. Okanite, I feel like is quite strong. So just, um, if you want something a bit more subtle, calcite is very, very good for you. Also selenite, I have a selenite tower right here. So a selenite is also very good. Also, if you want to connect and channel, the selenite is also very good for that. So I do feel like conclusions are within reach. Whatever you're going through right now, I feel like you're really, you are actually going through it and you're gonna be really, really prosperous on the other side of it, okay? The world is here to show you that your world is gonna be changing. You may not see it yet, but you're gonna, after you've come out of this energy of like nothing's, nothing's changing, nothing's happening, why do people keep hurting me, that sort of energy, you're gonna come out of it and think, damn, I'm actually, a, I'm actually an amazing person. Like I've gone through so much shit and I'm really, really proud of all the effort that I've put in. And um, you're going to be really prosperous. So I don't really think there's anything else I need to say. Basically, you are looking into all your past life patterns. You're going to be um, curing this, curing this. And not exactly like curing it, but that's not the right word. But kind of looking into your past life patterns and seeing what you need to um, release and what no longer serves you. I feel like you're really clearing out what no longer serves you. That, that quote is really coming through really strongly. Um, I feel like you guys need to say, I release anything that no longer serves me, if you feel like things are getting a bit too heavy, because sometimes your energy, you may feel like it's your own, but it may be somebody else's that you've picked up, so just possibly say this as um, advice. We also have all chakras and all chakras together. This is basically saying that you're really clearing out all the old stuff, all the negativity, and I feel like um, if you've got like a chakra bracelet with all the different chakra beads on it, or something with all the different colors that you can wear, um, I feel like it's gonna be very helpful to connect all your chakras together because you are on the right track. You are literally right at the end of a cycle. And you're gonna be going into a really amazing cycle very soon. I feel like at least in the next week or two, something's gonna suddenly change. I'm getting like a tower moment. And the next two months are gonna be absolutely amazing for you. If you're not feeling they're gonna be amazing, they may be a little bit heavy, but they're gonna be really, really good because you're gonna be clearing out a lot of stuff. In about two months, I feel like two months to two weeks, two weeks to two months is going to be where it's really going to start picking up. After about two weeks, I feel like after all this heavy energies has come, has come and gone from the Mercury retrograde, you're really going to start reaping the rewards, okay? So I really hope it's resonated with you. Thank you so much for being patient with me, guys. Honestly, it means so much. Um, I've missed you guys so much, so thank you so much for being patient with me. 
Um, if you would like to purchase a private reading, I'm doing private readings again. So all the information is down below in the description box. I have all the readings listed. Um, if you would like to comment down below if you've resonated. If it didn't resonate, then just let it fly. Also, if you'd like to subscribe to my channel, I would really, really appreciate that. Thank you so much, and I'll speak to you very soon. Bye. Hello, group number three. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. We have the gorgeous Amatrine here. Amatrine is a mix between amethyst and citrine. It's a really, really good crystal. Um, very, very good for um, OCD, for anxiety, that sort of thing. So you guys have got a lot of cards and I have quite a low battery. So just letting you know this reading may be a little bit shorter than normal, okay? So you have you and your loved ones are safe. Your hard work is paying off. Unikite or Unikite live in the present heart chakra. Zincite physical body root chakra. Business sacral chakra cinema. We also have the five of wands and the death card. I'm just going to move my camera a little bit so you guys can see a little bit more. Let's just give you a little bit more space to work with here. Okay, let's move this over a little bit. Okay, let's give you a little bit more room. Get these all on. We also have new opportunity, stand your ground, vacation, inner power, harmony, positive expectations and new location. Right, we've got new location and new opportunity. You guys are on the right track. You may feel like you're not because you're possibly going through a death process, but look at that. New location, new opportunity, amazing. You guys may feel like a little bit unsafe right now, but your hard work is absolutely paying off, okay? Remember to stand your ground. I feel like possibly family members could be really like nasty to you, or you could be feeling a little bit vulnerable right now. And just know to stand your ground. And just to know that possibly if things get a little bit too overwhelming, just to have a vacation it doesn't mean to like go abroad somewhere. It could mean to just literally stay in your room for like a few hours just to kind of reset. It could mean to just um, have a bath, meditate, um possibly go away for like a couple of days even if it's just like in the same country that you're in um to just have like some time away because i feel like you are feeling a little bit too rooted in your body you need to be a little bit more light and airy i feel like you need to be more in your heart less in your head and your root i feel like you need to be more in your heart um but you're really kind of embracing your inner power i feel like there's a lot of positivity coming towards you you guys have got a really amazing pile i feel like group one and group two are actually going through a lot of shit but i feel like you guys have actually gone through the shit and you're actually on the other side now or you're literally right on the edge of it right on the edge of like coming to the other side now so you may feel like you're getting a bit of conflict this could be the conflict in your mind you could be feeling you're a little bit too vulnerable right now you could be feeling conflict with friends or family but just know that you're going through a death process and you're going to come out the other side really really positive this inner power is coming through really really nicely i'm just going to see what's coming through after the death card what's coming after the death card thank you gorgeous the full amazing that's exactly what i want to see oh my god and the lovers amazing oh my god i'm so excited look at that that is look at that it's absolutely gorgeous that's exactly what i want to see got the lovers the three of pentacles so you could be meeting new people new friends you could be possibly being a new partnership you're going to get a lot of offers even if it's not a lot of offers you will get some sort of offer because you're moving into a new space this is absolutely new mental clarity that you're going to have um and look at this difference like the death card is so like dark and well pressing pretty much but the death card is absolutely amazing because this is like death and rebirth absolutely beautiful right after each other so that's why i couldn't see this full card yet because i feel like i had to pull that out just to have that impact of look how amazing this is because i feel like if you just literally saw the death card and the full straight away i feel like it wouldn't have had such a massive impact that's what they're showing me basically um so the full card is here to show you that you're on a really good track and you're i feel like you're going to start loving yourself more and you're going to have more balanced relationships and there's a lot of things that are going to be resolved in terms of past um, patterns and past emotions that are all coming up right now um and i feel like you just are probably going to meet people um in a new environment and in a new location so i feel like a new you version 2.0 is coming through really strongly this is resonating very very strongly with me as well so i definitely feel like you guys are really going to get a version 2.0 with yourself um and you're possibly going to be moving possibly going to go into a new job possibly into a new relationship like new location could even be like a new location in your life as in like like going from single to a relationship or relationship like uh, dating to like um boyfriend girlfriend or you know girlfriend girlfriend boyfriend boyfriend doesn't really matter but basically you're going from like a step up you're stepping up 
and going into a new opportunity which is absolutely amazing i'm not when i say stepping up i don't mean like you've been like not stepping up meaning like you're leveling up you're you're really leveling up and it's going to be absolutely amazing your hard work is paying off so if you're going through a really hard time right now just know that you are doing really really well and you should really pat yourself on the back and give yourself a lot of love so this is absolutely amazing guys thank you so much for being here and for being patient with me if you'd like to book a private reading for me i'm now doing private readings i'm doing private readings again so please look down below in the description box all my private readings are listed if you'd like to subscribe to my channel feel free um, if you'd like to comment down below if this resonated, if it didn't resonate then just let it fly. Also if you'd like to like this video I would absolutely love that. And yeah, thank you so much for watching and I'll speak to you very soon. Bye guys.